Hi, James Ellis Kirk here, London Golf School, and welcome to London Golf School's Question Time. Um, I've got a great question today, um, and thanks Mark for that. How would I learn golf again if I was going to start over? Brilliant question. Um, well, first things first, and this might be controversial, is that I wouldn't um, seek a golf lesson, uh, unless it was in myself or my colleague Steve. Um, no, I would do two things. I won't go online and I would take a golf swing, take a golfer that I liked or match my size or, or something. Um, let's for example, I would probably take um, Freddie Couples, one of my favourite golfers growing up. I would look online take his swing on video, I would definitely turn the sound down. I don't want to listen to anyone's opinions and um, of what they've got to say. And I would just put that on repeat and watch that over and over and over and over and over again. And then I would run into the garden and with that image in my head, I would take a golf club or a stick if I haven't got one. And I would just try to sort of create the essence of what my mind saw that was. And then I'll go back and do that again and again and again. Um, I often use this tactic when I um, teach beginners now because I've said this before, I think teaching is far too regimented. Um, I really can't stand the way it's been formulated and uh, into a number of step-by-step -step pieces. Um, so yeah, I'm often asking my pupils to go away, pick someone a golfer you like, take their swing, watch it over and over again. and and. And, and it helps them sort of cement the, the essence of the swing, the, 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 the essence, the feelings I want to get across early on in a golfer. So, so yes, I would just take Freddie Couple's swing and I would watch that over and over from front onwards and down the line, they call it, from behind. And I would just copy it. And I would copy it and copy it and copy it. Um, um, and then after, I don't know, a number of weeks, I would then venture down the range and, and see what happened when I put a ball in the way. The second thing I would do is I would watch some golf. I would watch some reruns of some tournaments. Now I love watching the classics. Um, in fact, I watched um, Freddie Couples win the Masters uh, just the other day. Um, it was wonderful. But as a beginner, if you if you watch some reruns, some highlights of uh, an hour's an hour's rerun of the the Open. You'll get to see golfers, the different styles, the way they stand to each ball, the way they hit the drivers, the way they play their short game, the way they putt. It will just give you a much more broader sense of the game than, than if I decided to learn golf and head straight down the driving range or to a golf club to a pro. And I learned it in that very old fashioned, formulated step by step way. So, Mark, if you are a beginner, <coughs> then you can follow this approach or you can contact me at james at londongolfschool.co.uk and we can uh, see if I can help you further. But I hope this was uh, answered your question um, well um, and I'll see you all next time. Thanks. Bye.